Are you a proud owner of Hammerhead Karu 1 or Karu 2 bicycle computer? And do you want to learn on how to install application inside your Karu Head unit? If you want to learn, let's watch this video. Hi, my name is Chak Ban, the owner of Ban Ban Cycling YouTube channel. I'm from Malaysia. So today I will share with you on how to install application to your Karu 1 or Karu 2. As you can see here, I'm using Karu 1. It did not ship to our country. I got this from eBay at a reasonable price because there's a plenty of people are selling it for upgrading to Karu 2. And uh, in my country, uh, it's I think there's an only few people that know the existence of this great head unit. Okay, before I start, I would like to give credit to dcrainmaker.com for sharing this article on how to sideload Android apps to your Hammerhead Karu 1 or Karu 2. So basically, my tutorial today is based on this guide by DC Rainmaker and I will share the link of the article in the description. Okay, before you start, you need to prepare a cable. It is advisable to use the cable that been provided by Hammerhead inside the box or any cable that compatible and you must make sure it can transfer data because some cable is only designed for charging. And then the next thing that you need aside from your Hammerhead unit, you need to have I'm using PC and this tutorial will based on the PC uh, usage and I cannot do a demo on Mac because I'm not a Mac user. Okay, after you already prepared the cable and also the PC, uh, we will go to our unit uh, and you will need to scroll to setting and in setting, uh, you need to scroll until about and scroll down until the box with builder number now you need to click off several times until there's a, a pop-up there for my case i already turned to developer option and then uh, go back and now you will see there's a developer option in the setting now open the developer options and scroll down until you see a section on debugging ensure that usd debugging is enabled and next scroll down until you see select usb configuration make sure you select mtp media transfer protocol and then uh, we are done uh, on the steps for our head unit now we will move to our windows pc to continue the steps for this site loading we move to the pc steps for this okay as i mentioned earlier uh, this video tutorial is based on dc remake article dated february 1st there and titled how to site load android apps on your hammerhead karu 1 and karu 2 we'll go to this step which it will require to install the Android developer tools on your Windows computer. From the link below and the article from the Serial Maker, you just click that link and it will guide you to this developer.android.com SDK platform to release notes. And click download or for Windows and it will download into your local drive. Uh, in my case, I already downloaded it. Platform tools are 30.0.5 Windows. Okay, the next step you need to do is you have to unzip it and copy all the files to a folder. And the easiest way, uh, because later you are going to use the command prompt, so set a folder inside uh, your C. Uh, I name it as Android and inside here you copy everything from the downloaded tools inside the folder Android here and I add another folder named apps because later we will use this folder to input the APK or the installer file for the apps that we want to install inside our Karoo. Uh, 
connect your Karu using the cable to your PC. Okay, now uh, your PC will identify your unit as Karu. You see here that nothing appear in this folder. You just can go back to your head unit and click setting. Go back to the developer options. Go to the USB configuration and just select MTP once again. And your computer will detect and now you can see the internal storage. We don't have to touch anything here. Okay, next we will use the command prompt to install the application. So go to your search, go to your search command prompt and open the command prompt to create the folder here in C because later we is for us to access it from command prompt. The next step is you go to apk pure to download a apk file for the apps that you like to install. Once you downloaded it, move the apk to this folder that we've already created in the android app then the folder name apps as a turning pigs version 10 1.1 okay go back to your common prompt in this common prompt you will type cd and backslash and then you will type cd the folder name that we created and write and now uh, we will key in adb.ex E devices so the system will detect that list of device attached is this is the ID number of the device now the next step uh, is the stage that we install the APK so you just type ADB install apps the folder apps backslash and this is just uh, the trick. You don't have to uh, type the whole uh, file name. Just put the 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 part of the name. Let's say training pics and type tab. So that is the APK file and press enter. Now you can see there's a moving percentage for for uh, the system performing push install to your unit. You need to wait for a while and later uh, when the apps is successfully installed on your Karu unit, it will straight away appear on the display. Okay, if you can see on the common prompt now, they state that success and have a look at your Karu unit and scroll the menu, uh, the below menu. Previously, it's only three dot. Now, it's uh, have another dot because they have to have a new page. Now, we have the training pick APK installed in our Karu. You can try to open it. And here we go, that the apps already installed. So like I mentioned earlier, you need to ensure that the apps are, uh, is compatible with the Android 6.0 and not require any Google services. I've tried to install uh, YouTube. Uh, it successfully installed but it's not working and there will be a pop-up come out saying that you need to have a Google service to run this application.
So we already successfully installed training pigs on my curl. So from the tutorial, I can say it's pretty easy to do it. And if you're not sure, you still can refer to DC Remaker article on how to do it. And my video is only to show on the house uh, because sometimes you cannot imagine what are the steps. So uh, I've tried few applications and like uh, the serial maker mentioned uh, sometimes we don't need the apps but uh, some people the requirement are different so uh, i like to encourage you guys to try to uh, sideload apps on your karu 1 or karu 2 to make it more interesting like this morning i already tried uh, for an indoor training with Zwift the Zwift companion working smoothly and that's all I wish you good luck and all the best please subscribe to my channel share and like the videos thank you